Hey guys, it's the Solo Coffee and today in so it's a monster analysis video. I'm going to be going over Firefool and I'm going to be telling you guys why you should get him out of his current breeding event. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Firefool is a support and he's actually one of the uh, better supports in the game. He used to be one of the best supports in the game, so he is still very, very good. And let's go on down to his traits. His traits are Burn Immunity, Torture Immunity, which is amazing, and then a Bulwark, AoE Random Elemental Weakness, and then AoE Random Torture. So his traits are not super super good but the torture immunity is really good and then the aoe's are okay it really depends on what you get though since they're random and then his relics are banner and staff which are both really great especially banner because you can get that gold banner that gives stamina to your whole team and then if we're going down to his pros and cons he can apply pr twice which is great for his support he also has access to two gray zero cooldown skills which is really good he also has a great trait he's got a great turn transfer he can also bypass dodge area he has good relics. He also has great speed, a low stamina cost, and his random effects are RNG based, meaning you could get something good, but that is also a con because you could get something bad. And then his other cons are no team NER and extra turns are anticipation bait. So if we go on down to his uh, move set, he has a random negative effect with AoE random torture effect, which is pretty good. He also has a PER with an AoE PER on the same move, which is really great. So one of those PERs is going to be a double. And then he also has an ally. NER which is really good with an extra turn and that also gives a random positive effect which is even better it would have been good even without that but it is very good with that and then he has another self extra turn with an ally random damage buff which is really good so yeah overall this monster is really amazing he has some great moves he doesn't have an AoE NER but the NER is an extra turn which makes it really good and yeah besides that his traits are pretty great and he has pretty great relics as well so yeah definitely go ahead and get fireful he is inside of a breeding event so he's very easy to get so he's definitely worth getting and yeah go and try him out on your team see if he works well with the monsters that you have and let me know down in the comments if he does and don't forget to like share and subscribe more videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye